Hey guys, this episode we're going to be talking about strict loading in your Rails applications when you're querying your database with Active Record. So strict loading is a feature you can enable uh, across all of your models, but you can also use it as a scope on your models. And you can mark it as strict loading by saying strict loading, um, and this will basically say, let's grab the first user, and if we try to load any associations on that, we will get a strict loading error because we have not included and preloaded those associations. So let's take a look um, at how we can use this in our Rails apps. So I'm gonna pull up VS Code here. We've got an author model, we've got a post model, and the post belongs to an author and a category. So we can look them up um, by author, display all their posts, their posts will want to display the category that it was in, and all of that good stuff. And I wanna show you how we can use this in Rails. So let's say we grab the first author, um, and we say strict loading on that to enable that. This author is going to have strict loading as true, and we can then um, ask for the associations on it. So if we go to our author, we have has many posts. So if we're gonna say a.posts, we will now get an error. And this error is an active record strict loading violation error saying that the author was marked for strict loading, which means that the post association named posts cannot be lazily loaded. So you will get an error anytime you try to load those associations without preloading them. So the way to make this work is when we load the user or the author, we wanna say includes or eager load, 